Hi, I'm Alia. So today I want to make a part two of the video I did yesterday. So for the words ki, kam and otkot. Okay, so if the city or the country is a masculine noun or a feminine noun, the endings change differently, yeah? So if uh, we take the word Zagreb, so Zagreb, the city, the capital city of Croatia, you would say kje si sem u Zagrebu, otkot si sem iz Zagreba, kam greš, grem u Zagreb. And it's the same for New York, it's also a masculine noun. So, kje si sem u New Yorku, otkot si sem iz New Yorka, kam greš, grem u New York. Okay? And now let's quickly just repeat what we did the last time for Slovenia. So Slovenia is a feminine noun. So kje si sem u Sloveniji, otkot si sem iz Slovenije, kam greš, grem u Slovenijo. And then let's take another, uh, let's say country um, Australia. So kje si sem u Australiji, otkot si sem iz Australije, kam greš, grem u Australijo. Okay, so this was a very quick video. I hope it helps. And just so that you're aware that uh, depending on if the noun is masculine or feminine, the endings change uh, in a different way. Yeah, so um, yeah, if you have any ideas for what video I should do next, next, please leave them in the comment section below. And I will talk to you guys soon. And yeah, take care. Bye.